plein air painting forces you to work quickly, 10 to 15 minutes uh, sketching out uh, what I see. These trees, this sky, this water, the, you know, the values, the colors, there's a lot to consider. Basically a composition is how your canvas is divided, where the horizon line is, where your major shapes are, and where the uh, major values are in your painting. One of the things I love about oil painting is that it's, it's one of the most forgiving mediums. You can paint a dark on a light area or a light on a dark area. It just, it's forgiving in that sense. You know, that's kind of the joy of plein air painting is, you know, you're doing the best that you can when you're outdoors. It's basically capturing the mood and the feeling of, of a place. I, that's why I like using big brush strokes uh, when painting. As you uh, get more experience plein air painting, you start to learn that you paint what you see, but you also know where to exaggerate. You find that you can actually push and shift these colors. You know, when you look out in the real world, when you look at the sky, the sky is so bright and so intense sometimes, and you just think, how am I going to interpret this in paint? I would mix my colors, and I would lay them down, and the sky would just never feel light enough. And when I'm painting on location, I think that's the sense of freedom, is that uh, whatever's in front of me is my inspiration. It's just me and my environment. It, it feels a bit like a home away from home.